Howdy ho my peeps. It is munch pack time. Um, you can see I'm here alone. Grant is not in his normal spot sitting right there um, because he is off visiting his children. So um, I'm doing our munch pack. Um, I'm doing our munch pack taste test on my own. I wanted Gracie to come, but she was working today, so it's just me. Um, so let's get right to it. Um, this one is made for you by Ronnie. So well, that's very cool. I just love the way these they print these little postcards, and they tell you how to how to enter a free family pack. You know, if you had if you were if you had this subscription, you could enter to get a a family back upgrade, which is cool. So I think I will. I've never done the, I've never entered, but I think I will. So first of all, we have our slip sheet, like always, and then I'll show you what it looks like on the, on the inside. Looks like some colorful, colorful snaps. So here we go. I'm going to start with this, Zaps Potato, uh, chips they are from the USA they are uh, dill pickle flavor so we'll give this a go oh I love the smell of a real you know oh I love the smell of dill mmm that's real good it's dill, but it all it also has almost a sweet flavor to it. Wow, that is good. Okay. Let's try the next thing. Um we have Churimais. Churimais. I'm sorry, I don't read Spanish real well. Uh con limoncito. It is like a, it's a crunchy corn strip that looks like a churro, and it's got spicy chili and lemon flavor. It is from, it is from Mexico. Well, I had a churro for the first time in years the other day, a, a genuine churro, the big, wonderful, deep fried things like you get at the fair. So good. So these look like tiny little churros, sort of. Of course, churros are sweet. And this is um, chili lemon. Mm. Very good. Mm. Great flavor. Two things right out of the box with great flavor. I like them both. Let's see here. Um, Oh, this is interesting. I don't know if I'm going to like it. Um, it is Speezy Orange Cola from um, Croatia. It's a bold cola mixed with zest zesty orange soda. That probably is going to require, yeah, this top is going to require a, um, a church key to open it so Let's see if I have anything. Let's see if I can make the end of this thing work. No. Doesn't look like there's anything in there. Okay, well then we're going to do the cola last and I'll have to find a... a um... Oh wait! Okay. Here we go. On my old key ring, I found this. All right. Let's give it a try. Oh, man. That is good. Oh, it is highly carbonated, which I love. I don't even taste the orange. It just tastes like a real strong cola. Kind of tastes like RC cola. Mm. 
that is good. I'm going to put that in the refrigerator to cool down. Finish drinking that tonight. Okay. Now we have some little gummy things. These are peach rings by Yummy Yummy uh, from Turkey. Yummy Yummy peach rings. That's what they look like. Let's take a Yummy Yummy peach ring. Okay, that's good. It has um, a genuine peachy flavor. You know, sometimes peach flavor can be nasty. This is good. Oh, it tastes like peaches. Okay. Now we have Riccolino Cranky Chocolate Corn Flakes from Mexico. Give these a go. Well, so far everything I've tasted I really like. That's a good sign. Okay, so this is what they look like. It's good. I was about to say I didn't like the chocolate taste. I was afraid it was going to be... Um, have a weird aftertaste, but it doesn't. So that's a good sign. Okay, this is Lottie Koala's March artificially flavored chocolate cream filled cookies from Thailand. All right. It's from Thailand and it has a koala bear on it. Oh, but I guess there's a game inside here. Oh, here it is. I'm not quite sure how this works. I don't know. I'm not quite sure how the game works, but let's try the let's try the little goodie. I just love the way they print um, <clears throat> liners and stuff for these uh, snacks. The ones that usually come from other countries other than the United States. Oh, look! It's got a little koala printed on it. Well, isn't that special? It's got a chocolate cream filling. A nice chocolate flavor. No weird aftertaste. Well, isn't that nice? Well, we're batting a thousand so far. We can even do that last. We have some granite nuts. Granites, coated and roasted peanuts, salty and crunchy from Colombia. Coated, roasted, coated, roasted peanuts. Give this a try. Coated. I wonder what they're coated with. Mm, just like a flower. Like a batter. Real thin batter. Boy, that's neat. That makes them a super crunchy. Those are fun. And just a nice peanutty flavor. Nothing weird. Fun. This is um, from Olker. It's Cat Cat Tat. Cat Cat Tat with cocoa filling. It's a fluffy, crunchy pastry filled with sweet cocoa hazelnut cream from Turkey. Let's take a little bite of this. See what we think. Okay. So it's a very flaky. I'm going to open it over the box because it's super flaky. Like well, you can see it's like falling apart flaky. So we're going to take a little. Woo! That is a falling apart snap. 
looks wonderful. Let's see if it, if it tastes wonderful. Oh, it does. That's like a, that real, it's almost like a, a dried out croissant with chocolate filling. It's good. Do you guys have ants? I have ants so bad, I'm trying to keep them out of this box because the box is going in the refrigerator when we're done uh, uh, testing, tasting. These are Arctic Classic Wafers from Russia. Oh, you damn little ant, stay off my box. Okay, I love wafer cookies. I've always loved these. Did you guys ever get the ones when you were kids that were, they had chocolate, vanilla, and strawberry wafer cookies all in the same, all in the same container. Those were so good. Okay, so it's a big, there are three of them in here, big old wafer cookie. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's so yummy. Mmm. I just love that texture. Okay. Now we have some Gelt Fruity Taffy Coins. Well, these things. A lot of you guys have Grew up with these. Okay. Oh, I'm not sure where they're from. Made in the EU. That would be the European Union, right? Well, I might as well show them to you. They're these little coin things. Most of you guys have seen these, I think. You have to peel off the gold coating. Oh, you damn little ant. Mm. Oh, that's yummy. Doesn't look like much, but tastes like a now and later. Or a high chew, something like that. Very good. I'm just checking to see if there's any more ants in the box. Ooh. Come here, you little bastard. You cannot have my snacks. That is not happening. Okay. I've got one more thing to try. It is a peach pie with real fruit filling. It's from the USA. JJ's Bakery Peach Pie. Oh, there we go. Now. I don't know if I told you this yet, but I'm not real fond of peach pie. I like peach cobbler with it when it's got a whole lot of vanilla ice cream on it. But I am willing to give this a go. Okay, so it looks like it's been coated with a sugar, maybe a, sh a sugar glaze or something. It's very moist. That's not an ant, is it? Not? Okay. Smells like Play Doh. Let's see how it tastes. The dough is weird. I'm so sorry, but the dough is weird. It tastes like Play-Doh, too. It smells like Play-Doh, and it tastes like Play-Doh. I'm sorry. There's one. I'm going to identify this as the dud in the box. I don't like it. Yeah, no. I know. I'll feed it to the ants. There we go. Distract them. Get them off the, the scent of the things that I want to finish eating. Oh, there's another one. Oh, die. Oh, and another one. 
Oh gosh. And then every time I smash one, I can smell formic acid. Okay. Well, I'm just going to hold this up off the table then. All right. So uh, this this month's munch pack for um, July is uh, really really good. Um, but I don't uh, but I don't like the peach pie. So if any of you guys out here have, have have tried this peach pie, this JJ's Bakery, and you like it, or you like any of their other pies, let me know. I'd like to know if it's just me and my prejudice against peach pie, or if, or if it really does taste like Play-Doh. Although, I know many of us have eaten Play-Doh as children, so that might be a plus, I don't know. Oh, so I guess I better put all this stuff back in here. Thank you, uh, you guys, for hanging out with me while I eat, uh, eat snacks. I think I'm going to take these over to my recliner, and I'm going to watch Glee from the beginning. Never watched Glee when it was on television the first time around. And um, and so I'm starting with season one, episode one, and I'm getting to know the people of Glee. I think that's everything. So, um, again, check the down bar, and that will give you the uh, link to signing up for your own lunchbox. Talk to you guys later. Bye.